Previously on Survivor. Survivor of the Prior Mountains began with 16 Montanans stranded in rural South Central Montana, forced to survive the arid landscape while competing against each other for the title of sole survivor and $150. Divided into two tribes, Bakpe and Awakale, they face the elements. The beans. Nobody likes the beans. Yeah. The beans are hideous. Yeah. Hey, you guys, you should look for shade. Sucked. It was terrifying. Okay. It was so cold. Schemed. We stay together. We yeah. can take out the couples. These little act of persuasion to get them on our side. Girl to guy ratio that will get picked up one by one. Yeah. Formed alliances. Like if us girls? Yeah. Because we're going to get voted off if we don't. Nice. And I asked him if he had some lines going on, and he lied to my face and said there wasn't, and obviously there is. I'm not trying to be the ringleader. And competed in challenges. So that they wouldn't have to face the dreaded hike to tribal council. On day one, Wakale went on a four challenge winning streak. And in the process, eliminated half of the Bakpe tribe. Sarah, John, Myra, David, the tribe has spoken. Like, I don't think you understand the emotional impact of this game until you have to turn on your teammates. On day two, the two strongest members of each tribe swapped. What? Watch your bandanas. We you are swapping back. teams. Aaron and Tully went to Bakpe, and Amanda and Kyle H. went to Awakale. But Amanda and Kyle's stay was short-lived, being voted out in the next two tribal councils. Amanda, Kyle, the time has spoken. It's time for you to go. Then came the merge. It's the two tribes have just merged into one. And despite the loss of Lauren. I'm, I quit. But I've survived enough. The Iwakale tribe headed by Brent, Emily, and Michael systematically began eliminating the Bakpe members. Aaron, Tully, Michelle. The tribe has spoken. And I feel bad, but it's just part of the game, and I hope they don't take it personally. But when Kyle, the last remaining member of Bakpe, won two immunity challenges in a row, the Wakali tribe was forced to eat two of its own. <laughs> That's three votes, Chris. I've been betrayed. Chris, Kia, the tribe has spoken. It's now down to four. Emily the outspoken leader of Awakale. First, first, you guys, first move is Aaron, if not, Aaron, if he doesn't have it, if that, Tully, we don't have to talk about it anymore over nope. there. Brent, the under the radar diplomat. I really don't think we should come off as like, well, you know, if you're nice to us, we'll give you sixth place. <laughs> I definitely want to avoid that. Michael, the schemer. It's just a big game of manipulation and it sucks, but I guess that's what Survivor is. And Kyle, the last of the Bach Pay tribe. My plan now, basically the same as it's been for a while, I have to win. Now, they will compete in their final immunity challenges. Two will move on to face the jury. One will outlast all the rest and become the sole survivor. That was the hardest vote this whole entire game. I feel really, really bad. I don't know, it just sucks when you have to turn on your own alliance, but I mean, I guess we knew that time was coming. We just wish it would have happened differently, obviously, but um, it didn't and it sucked and I never want to have to do that again, but I guess it's Survivor, I don't know. I just feel really bad, it was not fun. Well, it really just came down to the fact that I, it was a choice, obviously, between Kia or Brent, 
and I could screw over my old alliance or and create a new one or I could keep the one that I had. Either way, I've screwed over everyone else on the show that's in the jury, so there's no way that they'd be very favor favorable towards me in the final two. But what I figure is, you know, whatever happens, at least Brent, I wouldn't have screwed over Brent or Emily in the end. And that was one of the ultimate reasons why I chose to vote out Kia. Maybe I should tie it up just a little bit. I was disappointed. I don't... Kia and I both voted for Brent, and I was hoping Michael could realize that this game isn't going to make Brent and Emily hate him, but he seems to think it will, so he voted Kia and kept their friendship intact. Well, it sucked voting Kia out. It sucks voting anybody out this late in the game because we've all kind of come together as a tribe. You know, we've we spent three days together, which is just something. Um, you know, in the bonds you make, you don't want to see anybody go. Uh, somebody had to go, and I, pff, I got two votes. I'm just glad it wasn't me. Yeah, let's say no matter what, let's all come back and help. It's a really good feeling making it to the final four. You know, out of 16 people, I mean, that's the top 25% now. And it's just amazing being here. It's been a long, hard journey. There's been a couple hiccups here and there. But it's just an amazing experience, especially as the tribe that I was originally in. We were a very close-knit tribe, very unified in what we did and everyone's just been able to get along and it's been an amazing experience being on Survivor. Yeah. I got screwed being in the other tribe. And we did. And it couldn't feel too bad for you because you guys completely ganged up on the non-couple people when you were No, watching. well. Yes, you did. No, I, well, no actually what it, how it was gonna go, I made, an, I made a quick alliance with John Mm -hmm. When we were first starting out, after Sarah had got, gotten out, I made a quick alliance with him, and then it was going to be Michelle, and we were going to try to pick up uh, either Myra or David, but when we figured that that'd be a bad idea, and they might screw us over. And uh, before I went and talked to either Myra or David, um, Kyle and Amanda came up to me, and like, we should do the four of us, because at the time it was seven, four mm -hmm. takes them. So we're like, all right, that's the quicker way, that's the better way, more security. Yeah. 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 You know, I think it all depends on this challenge and who gets immunity. If Kyle gets immunity, um, I think Michael will probably go home. If if not, Kyle's going home. And I don't know, I just see me and Brent as final two. Uh, if I, I think that if Kyle wins the next two, he approached, he approached Emily and me about voting on Michael. But the problem with that is I think that if Kyle makes it to the final two, he is going to win because I think the jury isn't angry at him, and he like and he's persevered through a lot, um, being the last member on his tribe still here. Uh, so we, we just gotta win this next challenge and make sure Kyle doesn't. My plan now, basically the same as it's been for a while. I have to win because I've tried absolutely every way possible to see if they want to vote out Michael first. They won't do it. See if they they want to vote Emily out. No, Brent. No. I, can't get them unless I win immunity. If I win immunity, then they'll probably vote out Brent, or vote out Michael, and then I'd have to win it again in order to get to the final two. Tree mail. Tree mail? Got mail. You guys ready? Yeah. Pass. It's down to four. Only three can move on. How much recollection of the past can you spawn? Head to tribal head to tribal council like you always do. Your fate in this game is waiting for you. Head to tribal council? Yeah. Well, let's go to tribal. Um, so we're gonna have to remember. So I don't care why we're going to tribal right now.